everyone, friends. It's Christina with the Reborn family. Let's see if I can figure this out. Here we go. Okay, I'm gonna turn him actually Let's go here so I can see it. Oh, this is so cute. Okay, so this is a card. It looks like it's got like um like potpourri in it, which is really cool. Um, so his artist's name is Paula. And I cannot say her last name. Um, as I mentioned, she's from Portugal. I will put all of her information in the description below as far as her name and links to her social media. Oh, okay, so this is his picture book. So I'm not gonna give it away just yet, but I will show you guys his photo book at the end. It's very cute. This is so cool. Okay. <clears throat> and I'm sorry if I keep clearing my throat. <clears> throat> um, Okay, and you're gonna hear the girls in the background. As I said, it's just me and the girls today and they are in the other room um, playing with their toys. So this is a really cool bag. We got some goodies in here. Let's see here, okay. It smells really good from that potpourri, I think. Oh, how cute, I've never gotten anything like this. This is so cute. Look at this little teddy bear. And he's super soft. I love how tiny he is. Perfect size for my little boy. Ooh, oh, these are cute. We got pacifiers and I've never had, I don't think I've ever had a yellow pacifier. Um, and I love, I actually love yellow. I'm surprised I don't use a yellow more often. Look at that. How cute is that pacifier? I love that. Um, you know what, that's not true. I have had a yellow pacifier once um, from uh, Holly Paz, uh, baby that I got so but that Holly Paz does her pacifiers differently I think I mentioned that before so her pacifiers can only work with her dolls so her magnetic pacifiers will never work with any doll except a Paz baby um, so I don't even know where that what happened to that pacifier I probably went with one of the babies when I um, adopted it out but look at how cute this is with the little uh, little puppy dog it's a little Scotty dog, which um, I have my, I have a family member, um, some family that is Scottish, actually a couple, so part of my family is Scottish. And so um, they love, like we used to, my mom used to collect Scotty dog, like Christmas ornaments and um, different things like that. We had, um, we used to have um, schnauzers. And so we would have a lot of schnauzer stuff, but we also had Scotty stuff. And my parents, before they got a schnauzer, they were debating between a Scotty or a schnauzer. So Scotties are very near and dear to my heart. <laughs> getting, I did uh, help the girls with something. They were getting all hyper, so I, I gave them a project to do. Okay, let's see what else is in here. It smells really good. Is it this that smells good? What is this? What is this? Look at this cute little box. Let's see. It's like, what is this? This is super cute. Wow. Never seen anything like this. Okay. Is this what smells good? I can't figure out. Okay. Oh, it's a pacifier clip. Okay. How cool. Wow. This is definitely not from, from here. This is, wow. This is so cute. Look at this pacifier clip, you guys. I don't know if you can see that. It's really cool. Very cool. I've never had a pacifier clip like that ever. So it's obviously not from, it's not in English. So it's obviously not from here, which is really cool. I love getting things from other countries, absolutely love it. Um, it came with this little thing in the box. So that is really cool. Um, any like unique items from other countries, I love. Um, Ebdahal Abul, she's a sculptor uh, and reborn artist. I got my Delilah from her and she sent some things from her country and that was like one of my favorite things ever. Um, she sent this really cool puzzle. Um, which we attempted, but it uh, we, we never completed. I think we, we might try, that would be a really good project now that's winter and we're indoors. Maybe we'll complete that puzzle and share it with you guys. Okay, let's see here. Got one more, I think after this, it's gonna be baby time. I can't tell. Okay, let's see, oh, this looks cute. I can open this. I like the colors. Oh, how cute. Okay, so his photos were in this. Oh my goodness, this is, look at these little socks. So cute, and that's really soft. I love these socks. Look at these socks. I actually, even though they're kind of, I guess you could say feminine, 
with the bows. I think they're super cute on boys in the navy blue. I love navy blue too. Um, look at this little bib. Oh, so cute. It's got little um, anchors. My husband actually was in the navy, so I love this kind of stuff for the babies. Oh, wow, this is so cute. Oh my goodness. I love this. This is very, very, very cute. Oh, I'm so excited to have a boy again. Uh, we had Carter for a really long time. He was our main boy and we did actually adopt him out recently. So I've been missing having a special boy. Um, so I'm really excited that we get, we get a special boy again. Okay, so we've got his pacifiers, his pacifier clip, his teddy bear, all his cute little outfits and accessories. Let's see here. Let's see one other thing under here. Ooh. Oh, I just said I like getting things from other countries. And look at this. Look how cool. We've got chocolate. My husband will love this. Good thing he's not here. I'll hide it. Um, we've got chocolate from Portugal, which is so cool. And then it's got his artist. So her name is Paula Lobato Faria. I'm probably butchering her name, but that's her card there. It's really cool. So we've got um, Mercy Finest Selection, and it's got tons of really yummy flavored chocolates. I will, I will share this with my husband happily. I will love that. That looks really yummy. So thank you very much, Paula, for that. And I think it's baby time. Oh, he's tiny. Oh, I'm so excited. Okay. All right, I'm gonna get all this out of the way so we can open him up. He's wrapped up really cute. I'm gonna have to show you guys when I get this out. Okay, look at how cute. I'm all about presentation. And I just, look at this beautiful presentation. How cute is that? So cute with the little unicorn and the blue blanket and the blue bow. It's just super cute. Really soft blanket too. Okay. So excited to meet this guy. So this, he was actually a custom that I had ordered um, a long time ago from his artist. And she did inform me that it was gonna take a while because she's, um, she's very popular. She's a very, very talented artist and very, very popular. Ooh, I love this blanket. Um, anyway, and so uh, I've been waiting a while for this guy and, um, and I'm so excited he's finally here. Oh, how cute. My goodness, okay. Look at these little, these little legs. So this kit is a kit that is not seen super, super often. So I'm not sure if anyone is gonna know the kit. So I'll just go ahead and say it. It's the Theodore kit. Um, and I actually need to look up who the sculptor is. I'll make sure uh, below in the description, of course, I'll put the sculptor and the sculpt name, which is Theodore. Um, and then of course, all of the artist's information and links to her social media pages if anybody wants to reach out to her. She does accept customs, but like I said, there is a waiting list for several months because she's she's popular. She's a really, really talented artist. So his cute little legs. He's weighted amazing. Very, very, very nice waiting. Okay, here we go, guys. Oh, and he is a rooted baby. I've been having a lot of um, painted hair babies, but he's got real hair. He's a rooted baby. Oh my goodness. Oh wow. He's got hat head, but he is so cute. Oh, oh wow. He could he looks like he could be our baby. His coloring kind of looks like us, I think. Like my husband and I. Okay, look at this baby, you guys. Look at that face. The little pouty lips. Rooting is amazing. He's got hat head, so I gotta brush his hair, but his rooting is incredible. Um, 
He's just so sweet. So I'm gonna go ahead and reveal his name. We haven't decided to name him Campbell. Campbell Theodore. Uh, and like I said, he is the Theodore kit. Oh, he's so cute. Wow. Oh, okay. Um, and so this is this is little baby Campbell. And I am just blown away by the realism um, in his in his face, his facial features, just the way that she painted him is is incredible. Oh, he's so cute. Um and then his hair. I mean, this is a really, really stunning rooting job. I mean, he looks, look at that. Like, if I was just holding him, definitely looks like a real baby. I can't wait to share him with my husband. Oh, I think he's gonna really like him. He loved his pictures, so I think he's gonna like him. All right, you guys, so let's look at his photo book real quick. Let's see, here you go, buddy. Look at the Campbell baby. There you go. Okay. So he's got this incredible photo book. I love, I love when babies come with photo books. Um, Carter came with a photo book and I'm, I think that might be the only one I got with a photo book. Oh, okay, so his birth certificate. Okay, it says the um, sculptor's name is Linka. I can't pronounce the last name, but I'll put that in the description. Um, his date of birth was January 24th, 2022. So he, as soon as he was finished, she like shipped him out. He got here really quickly. Um, so there is his birth certificate, and then we've got one of his photos there. Really cool, I love this, that she made the book like this with the certificate and all that, and look at, so here's the outfits um, that he actually has on him, the, the yellow outfit he has on him now, and then he came with this as well, which is really cool. It's cool that he came with a lot of the stuff that was in his photos. And then again, look at this rooting job. So cool. Just so real, I should say. So realistic. He's just such a beautiful boy. And so just a very realistic boy. And then his COA, here's another picture of him. But and then his COA is here. So that's the prototype on the COA there. Um, <clears throat> very cool. Oh, and he is, so it's a, a limited edition. Um, he's number 157 out of 1600. So the Theodore kit is a limited edition. I'm not sure if it's sold out or not at this point. Um, but I did hear, one artist told me that he was sold out and one artist told me that the kit was not sold out. So I really don't know. But um, either way, it's a really, really uh, beautiful kit. And Paula did an absolutely gorgeous job on him. Um, he is just so sweet and he again he's weighted so nicely very heavy heavy boy I like my heavy babies so um, my Laura is really heavy too by Jennifer Linkovics my Laura is uh, uh, I, we named her Claire so Claire is heavy so we got Claire and Campbell I think they're gonna make really cute siblings all right you guys so normally I would change them into like an outfit I had picked out and um, reveal the name, but I already revealed his name. And like I said, um, we're all kind of sick right now. So I'm going to go play some games and snuggle up with the girls and, um, introduce them to Campbell. And, and we're definitely going to bond and spend some time with him. And, uh, I can't wait to take him on an outing. Uh, I think that he's definitely going to fool people <laughs> into thinking he's a real baby. He looks very real. He feels very real. So I'm excited to spend time with him and bond with him. If you haven't done so already, be sure to subscribe. If you like this video, give Campbell a like uh, and um, check out our Instagram. I'll be posting a lot of pictures of him there. All the links are in the description below. Thanks so much for being here, guys. We love you. You're important to us. Bye, Reborn friends.